Bro, I'm, I'm speechless. <laughs> I'm speechless. That, like I said, I, I'm speechless. I, I don't, I don't know what to say, bro. Like, y'all requested this, and I see why, bro. Like, um, I'm gonna just say, like, as far as like the video, man, and the concept, like. As far as the dancers and Jimin, bro, they do an amazing job, bro. Just everybody being so synchronized and on point. Like, yeah, I, I think it's like, it's, it's, it's mind boggling to me to see them, like how on point they are as far as their dance moves and just like in general, like, just like how coordinated they were, bro. Like every single, like the fact that he was amongst them in the beginning and kind of like, I don't know. I feel like I've seen that in a movie somewhere to where it was like, People were like, you kind of blend in with the crowd, but then it's like, you look and then this person is here. And I'm like, oh, how did he even get here? Like, I wasn't, I was so focused on the dancers and the p other people, it was like, it was just like, yo. I also want to say this too. And I feel like this is what Jim is doing. Hurry up. <laughs> I feel like this is what Jim is doing. As far as, I, I don't know what it is, like this dark thing, but it's like coming to light every time. Yo! I, I knew he was going to say that. Uh -huh, that's why I said it. Uh -huh, I knew he was going to say it. That's why I said, let me go first, bro. <laughs> like, he keeps doing that for some reason. Like, he did it in the one we just watched, like crazy. He wore white and, like, the darkness took him. I don't know what this darkness is, but he also did it in this one, too, as well. Well, they, they said that, I guess, during the pandemic, he was going through, like, a really depressed time. Uh -huh. So, I feel like, in a sense, because even in, like, crazy, it was like, it was like the... I don't know, it gave like the Spider-Man feel in a sense, like kind of like when the Venom is like, oh yeah, on Spider-Man and they like, I don't know, it kind of controls them in a sense. Cause you can even see it, like you said, like uh -huh. once it got on them, it's like the whole scene had changed to like a dark scene. Uh -huh. It was like, it, it may have not been dark, but at the same time, people were wearing dark colors and like mm -hmm. he went from what he was wearing to something dark. Uh -huh. I kind of feel like that was like indication kind of telling us like, all right, look, this is maybe going through something dark because uh -huh. even you know towards the end it's like he, he, he made it seem like he couldn't i don't want to say could get it off of him uh -huh. but it just looked like it kind of took over him uh -huh. and i feel like they try to really give some type of symbolization in what they're doing and i feel like it's like we gotta catch it and uh -huh. you know it's people that out there that kind of like they already know you know they can kind of just read behind it and of course it tells you but at the same time i feel like for us to kind of like try uh -huh. to grasp it and kind of uh -huh. understand it because even for that too uh -huh. like set me free part two i like is you talking about the end right yeah because it's like he is like all of that was like gonna yeah it's, it's basically pretty much the same almost the, kind of the same and then it's like crazy like it's kind of like I get pulled into this darkness, then I get set free from this yeah, darkness. and it's like i get pulled into this darkness i get set free from this darkness but just the way he's like doing it in different like ways of like showing how he's getting pulled into darkness just like bro it's so captivating bro like literally this video was just like my thing is you could watch one of these bts videos on mute and still give the same reaction mm -hmm. only because the compassion and behind what they do bro is cr like i don't think people understand how difficult that is to move in a group of people and have your position alone like let alone be able to deliver but at the same did you see like when they were moving and i guess when he was moving in certain areas like it was like he just knew where mm -hmm. they were mm -hmm. so it was like automatic to kind of like i don't know that in itself was like bro that is talent that's like pure like dedication to something that you have to like and put me on the set so i can just see what it looks like and, um, and it makes me upset too because Slap yourself. Nah, I ain't gonna do it. <laughs> it really makes me upset with myself, and I think it probably makes Caden upset too. But, like, bro, with everything we do going forward, and this is on a different level, everything we try to do as far as going forward, bro, I wanna put that much passion yeah, for real. into what I do, bro. Whether it's, it's even creating content for you guys, like, bro, the passion they put into their videos, like, if I saw that as a person, in the US and I saw how they were passionate and so much passion, bro, I would change my whole video style. Yeah, for real. If I was a rapper, I would change my whole video style. If I was a pop artist, I would change my whole video style. And I'm not saying change my style to, to mimic their style, but bro, I would put more passion and more energy behind yeah, what I'm doing, energy, bro. effort, like. Because what, what they portrayed and what they did in this video, bro, like even the fact when they ran, like they ran for like a quick second and then stopped, bro. I'm like, bro, stuff like that, like 
gives me chills, bro. Like, cause it's just like you can feel the energy. In yes, it. bro. It's so captivating, bro. It's almost like watching a good anime scene to where it's like the anime character is so passionate in what they're saying. Like, you get like, like they yeah. are acting, whatever the case may yeah, be, it's... music, anything, bro. Whenever they put the passion and put their life force behind it, bro. You can tell, and yeah. you can tell this resonated with him to where he wanted to portray something to where he's going through. And you know, on the side note, I hope, man, I hope all of them are all right, and I hope Jemin's okay no, for, real, bro. for what they're going through, man. I I know it's 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 dawning and it's hard, you know, man. Like so, prayers out to them, man, and and to him for what they're going through. Hopefully, because it's it's a lot, bro. It's a it's it's a lot to be in the spotlight and to deal with this darkness. And even for him to be able to express it in his music, to some people don't even want to express stuff in the, in their and music. Not but only it's like, that, it's like at the same time, it's like you are to other people's. I, and I don't know, I'm not going to say this and say it for BTS. It's like for other people that may look at them, not, you know, like true diehard fans or people that's been with them. It's like you kind of just see them as an artist as opposed to a human being. Yep. And it's like so quickly can you just be like, all right, you know, they should be good. They got money. You mm -hmm. feel me? They... But to see what they have to go through and endure, and it's like to 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 give like the energy and the effort behind everything that they do, bro. You can see how it could be. It's just it's wear and tear on a person, bro. Like it, even if you know they're good at it, it's still a lot, bro. Mm -hmm. So, you know, like I c I couldn't hold back my composure as far as yeah, smiling I mean, and like, bro. It's like instant instantaneous. It's like yo, you can't even fake it. You can't fake it with stuff like this. It's like you just automatically are like yo, like <laughs> I'm just like yo, this man. <laughs> They be going in, bro. Exactly, like, bro. Like, I, like sometimes, like I said, I don't be trying to have four smiles and stuff like that. Like, nah. just smiling on camera, just be, but, bro, this stuff be really making me smile. Be just how like compassionate they are, like, just the whole movement and like being on point. And I swear, if you guys can tell me if one of those moves, like not moves, but like the choreographed part that they did, spelled something, I feel like it did. If you can tell us if it did, I feel like it maybe it, it could have. I been. was trying to look at that too. It was like a. a I don't know. I didn't catch a whole bunch of choreography that had different mm -hmm. letters, but I know that it was like a six or yeah. a, I don't know. Like, yeah, like I, I said, know. I know it probably has some but symbolism, he, and also too the the words on his body. Like, if you could, like, I know that stuff probably has some symbolism too. Like, as far as what he was trying to say, or or you know, it could have been you know emotional words on his. I don't. I don't know. I didn't pay it. I was so captivated by. Look, I was trying to look everywhere, bro. I was trying to look at the dancers. Him, like my eyes was going like. And it made it made me mad to actually not have. I know you know people gonna get on. Some people gonna get on it. Some people gonna understand because you know why we don't do the captions. But at the same time, I was like, damn, I want to know what he's saying, bro. But you could just tell that even within itself, as far as of course, the part of the course was in English, but it's like it, you could just tell that it's something he's trying to escape, mm -hmm. and you could see that from the video. And just the delivery of how they did the whole video. Mm -hmm. But I'm like, yo, shout outs to Jimmy, shout outs to these dancers, bro. That's like, when you look at their dance, bro, it's like on a, mm, it's on a whole nother level. It's yeah. like, it's, it's crazy. Like all of that in the beginning, bro. <laughs> like I said, it was it was captivating <laughs> from start to finish, bro. And guys, thank you for the react for the request. Like I know you've been hitting us up, like. React to this, react to something, pre react to something. So we definitely got it out there for you guys. Yes, um, sir. Definitely wanted to get that to you. Um, I feel like we're gonna get, get on out of here. Guys, keep on sending those requests. Like I said, we're glad to be back. <laughs> hell no, hell no. I just wanna be in the video. Just get me on the side. Like, I don't, I don't know what I could do on the side, but I would try. Like, if they got that much passion. I just want to do something with a lot of passion, bro. Like, I just want to do something Don't you like. You go wipe your ass with a lot of passion. <laughs> 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 guys, we're going to go ahead and get out of here as usual, guys. Once again, my name is Kogan. It's your boy, Kate. And that's Skull Pack Reacts. Yeah. <laughs>